How are we doing today, Jesse? Really good. Awesome. I'm tired from last night. Yes. You know. The choir concert. It was a big success. Yes. Um, it was really awesome. So um, but today is National School Nurse Day, so thank you, Mrs. Cunningham. Also, Woo! yesterday I did a jump split, and my leg is kind of feeling it. Today I might need to go to the office. <laughs> yes, yeah, so What's today this? for sports, we have baseball against Bexley. It's at home, and it's senior night, so come and support them. It will be really fun. And then also today, we're going to go to chapel first and then family time. So chapel at 11, and then you'll from there you'll go to family time. So remember that. Don't go to family time first. Sounds like a plan. Yep. Also, guys, we have guys block rock and girls gathering. And on top of that, battle over books with the Mr. Stoll mm -hmm. in the media center. I yes. can't wait. Yes. So what else do we have today? And now we have a Wild Wednesday video for you guys. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Good morning, WC. Hey, we are here this morning with Zach and his tortoise, Bob. Bob. Tell me a little bit about your tortoise here. Well, Bob is a uh, red-footed African tortoise, mm -hmm. and uh, we actually bought this for my daughter uh, for her 10th birthday, so he's... Uh, eight-ish years old, and uh, so he, as you can see, he's very active and he loves being out uh, exploring. So he's been he's been a really fun, fun pet for us. That's cool. Now, if he's a red-footed tortoise, so if you can uh, get a close-up, you can see that the bottom of their feet are red. And red-footed tortoises are known to be super social animals. Um, they like being around people. They're very gregarious. They will come and find you. Yeah, true. Yeah. Totally yeah. true. And um, and we were talking that Bob, on his shell, he's got these um, parts of his shells that come up. They pyramid. And they're supposed to on this one. But we have a, he's got one down here that just hasn't come up. And we were discussing that uh, how to kind of correct that because in tortoise care, just like any other animal, they they have specific needs that they need. Now, Bob is eight-ish years yep. old. Now, I have a little contrast here for us. And this contrast, we'll put them side by side. This is Eva. And Eva is our sulcata tortoise. And you'll notice that Bob doesn't have these spurs. Well, she's a spur, spurred African tortoise. And she's got these little bumps here on her feet that are spurs. And so I don't even know if I can convince Bob to go in. Yeah. Yeah. See, he can. He gets all in his shell. Well, that's all the further she goes in her shell. But she uses these as a defense mechanism to keep predators at bay. And you can see that the size difference between them. Crazy. <laughs> Bob's eight. Eva's two and a half. Let me show you a few years difference then. Somebody who's a, a little bit younger than Bob, but still maybe like six, seven years old. Look at that. <laughs> 